this. I made a mistake. On the fishing charter, I had a customer that hadn't released a fish before, and it's my job to show the clients how to release the fish. Well, what happened is you get your fish on the boat. You've already fought him for probably five minutes. That fish is stressed out. You're over here trying to get your Instagram photo, which you need because it's really freaking cool. But the problem is you have put all kinds of stress on that fish. So what's important is when you release that fish, you want him to be in a non-stressful environment, fully recovered, so he can hit the water and go so he doesn't, doesn't happen to him. Well, in this particular case, wasn't necessarily paying attention enough. It didn't explain that well enough. 27 inch redfish, put him back into the water like this. Splash, kind of stunned him. I noticed that he didn't recover fully yet. And then I look up and go, oh no. Here comes a pod of dolphins, baby dolphins, mama dolphin, and daddy dolphin. And there was a feeding frenzy. So we lost that redfish. And the biggest problem is now that redfish can't go out and reproduce and make more babies so we can catch more redfish and it's all good for the ecosystem. So what I wanted to show you today is the correct way to release a redfish. So what you're gonna do is you wanna take your redfish, you simply wanna lean over the boat and place him in the water gently. I generally like to hold his tail and do a back and forth motion, allowing all that water get up in his gills and get him nice and revived. And then I actually like the redfish to try to swim out of my hand. That way I know as soon as he lets go, shoo, he's off, gone, and there is not a... I didn't set him up for failure to escape from sharks, dolphins, or any other big fish out there that might want to eat him. So this is kind of what that looks like. I highly suggest releasing your fish that way. That way, like I said before, they go out and reproduce. There's more fish for you to catch later and it's better for the ecosystem. And you didn't just give somebody a free meal. So if you like this video, hit that like button on the next video. So hit that subscribe button. And most importantly, be sure to tell somebody you love them. <laughs>